Okay, now I'm going to be shooting the 22 caliber jumbo heavy with the crawl puncher breaker 50 yards away. I just shot one shot and that was the velocity I was getting. So. All right, let's see what, what we get again. Okay, that was five shots with the uh, 22 uh, exact heavies. Okay, now I am going to be shooting five shots with the uh, Benjamin Dome Ultra Magnum at 50 yards, the same as the JSB heavies. So those two shots I used took were the they were right next to each other. One went in the other one, so Okay, that was side shots with the uh, Crossman Ultra Magnum. All right, let's go see you down range now. Okay, these five shots were the JSB heavies, 18 grains, 50 yards, and these two, sh these five shots here were the. Crossman Ultra Magnum domes. So the first two shots went in here and then the rest came down here. So I know I was shooting, shooting them pretty uh, fast. So I, I am going to turn on the power with them. That's not bad. I was ex expecting just a little bit better performance from the GSB heavies, but that could have been me there. I just turned down the power with the on the crop puncher breaker 22. I'm I am going to be shooting the Premier Domes Ultra Mag. That's the velocity I'm getting, 380 and 23. All right, let's see if we can get some better groups with the 
at a lower velocity. All right, let's go down range and see what we get. Those are the 22 grain, I mean, 14 grain Crossman Domes Ultra, Ultra Magnum. As you can see, my my velocity was, was jumping up, up and down, so I'm not really expecting that much from them. That's just uh, over an inch at 50 yards. I am going to be putting the regulator on my car puncher breaker, not sure when, but hopefully that regulator helps with the accuracy. I'm, I'm thinking about just making my 22 puncher breaker, just using it for pellets with the Crossman domes. I can get them here at the local tractor supply and probably in, in Amazon as well so it's not bad I did do some other stuff to my crop puncher breaker so the reason you see the velocities jumping up up and down is because I did some stuff to it so now I'm going to be Probably using the the Hudson Nova now. Probably making some 50 yard uh, 50 yard groups. And as you can see, I wasn't using the shroud, so that could have played some uh, with my accuracy. I just got a new scope for this gun today. Uh, got it from uh, Sportsman's. This is the scope here. It's it's a nice scope. I think I got it for like ninety five dollars. I think it was a nice deal, I guess. And I also got this shooting bench. Or shoot, what is it called? This thing here. So I can probably make some better videos now with the accuracy. All right, now now I'm going to be using the 177 slug gun. <laughs> 